Alright dude, we're going on another fucking camping trip. We're going with all of our parents, which is fucking sick because we don't have to cook food. We got trailers to stay in. So let me show you guys what I'm bringing. My dirt bike and my truck. I've never pulled a trailer before in my entire life. So this is gonna be interesting. Let's take a little peek inside this trailer. My parents' Razor that they just bought. 2014 Polaris RZR. Two cases of Coors Light. And then guys, I'm gonna be reviewing Kona Big Wave for the first time. I've never even had a sip of this beer. All right guys, we fucking made it. The trailer made it pretty smoothly. We're at camp with all the parents. Maybe I'll give you guys a little tour tomorrow. Uh, I know a lot of these parents don't like being affiliated with my content, so. Uh, but here we are, Whitewash Sand Dunes, Utah. This is my dog, Luna. We call her Poon. Me and my dad started calling her Poon, and my mom didn't know what Poon meant, so she went along with it. Now she's Poon. She's pretty old. Both ACLs redone. She's basically like a veteran linebacker in the NFL. <laughs> Fully built out fish taco. Nothing better. It's hammer time. Yeah. This is after how many drinks? Nine, maybe. That'll do. That's not going to hurt anybody, is it? All right, guys. We're cashing in on night one. We're in my parents' trailer. Don't forget this parents' trip. Shout out, Boonzy. We'll see you tomorrow. We're rolling. All right, guys. Starting up the old bike. It'll start first kick. That was a such a fucking piece of shit! First kick. God damn it! First kick! This beer flipped out of a razor. And uh, I'm the kind of guy where there's no man left behind, so I stopped and picked it up. Hard crack. This trail is epic for razors. <laughs> it's kind of hard riding with razors. If you uh, ride dirt bikes, you know it's hard to go slow with the razors, with all the fucking... Whatever, dude, I'm not complaining because they bring beer. I would show you guys the crew, but like I said, nobody wants to be affiliated with me. <laughs> Look like fucking Johnny Bravo got lit on fire. It's just crazy. We have all these rocks and sticks, and then we just made Bluetooth out of all this, and we're just on a big flying saucer through space. Guys, look at this little fella. His name is Radar. <laughs> He's freaking packing, dude. Doing a little cornhole tournament. Random teams, they were already assigned. Double elimination, we got 10 teams, I think. So this is gonna be a little bit of a doozy. We're gonna be here a while. And I've already won game number one. And then I'm gonna film a little crowbar. All right, guys, this is my fucking crowbar for uh, tonight. There's no way I'm gonna find my way back here, but uh, we're gonna be doing Kona Big Waves. If you guys wanna watch this episode, make sure you're following me on TikTok or Instagram. I'll have the link to all of those in the bio. I'll also probably have it on my YouTube shorts, so check that out too. Tad bit of a mishap opening the first Kona big wave. Tried to open it uh, using my makeshift crowbar. Obviously didn't go that great. I'm gonna go get a bottle opener. I'm probably five Kona big waves down. I'm enjoying them. I wish they were colder. Uh, that's kind of just a circumstantial issue. Doesn't matter. What we're really here talking about is the cornhole tournament. I took third place. Me and my partner gave it our all. And wow, what a championship. Wow, what a championship. Tensions are heated, shots are flying around. I'm not taking any because I'm strictly drinking Kona Big Wave to give you guys an accurate review. Make sure you guys check that out. I know I already said it before. Check it the fuck out. Love the Cornell Tournament. It's an annual thing and uh, I wouldn't change it for the world. Ah! Guys, I picked him up. He's actually chill as hell. Not even gonna lie. And he's got a big penis. We drank all the Kona Big Waves. If you guys want my opinion on it, make sure to check out that video. I know I've said it three times now, but uh, we're about to go make it. There's going to be a shock dog collar involved. We're going up to max fucking shockage. Hopefully my fucking heart doesn't stop. I have gone through all 12 of these. So we just finished the Kona Big Wave crowbar. I did it with the fucking dog collar on. Dude, if it doesn't get taken down, this is a hilarious video. That shit fucking hurt. The cone of big waves are only 4.4%, so. What are we at? 0.15. 0.15. But unless you've been shocked on the neck by a dog collar, you really don't know. Level 18 is like if your dog is mauling a kid. Like, that's the 
only reason you would use level 18. All right, guys, the end of night number two. Total fucking success. We're going to bed at a uh, 0.152. Epic fucking day. We'll see you tomorrow. Be in. Next morning, we'll get a little breathalyzer test. Uh, seeing, seeing if I'm over the legal minute. Minute? minute. Oh no, one nine. Today is gonna be a good day. I don't know what sort of tomfoolery we're gonna get into, but. Uh, <coughs> that's my sad wolf. Look at this. We got some paragliders. Wow, that's pretty badass. I'm afraid of heights, but I think I would do that. That shit looks fun. Let me know if you guys want me to find a place and figure out how I can do that. Just a little toe drag. Look at that shit. Gotta mix oil into my gas. Two stroke problems. You fill up a water bottle, not all the way. Really, brah? But like, pretty pretty full. When you put it into exactly five gallons of gas, you get a pretty much 40 to one ratio, which is exactly what I like to run in my bike. Into the bowl. And now you just shake the fuck out of it. Nice weather we're having, isn't it? Woo woo! That was really fucking cool. All the moms just did a freedom funnel, so I'm gonna do a full one. Hard crack. I'll show these freaking rookies how it's done. They're all behind the camera, too. Yeah. <laughs> all right. Cheers. Yeah, he does. Bird shit. Okay, we're all in this little riverbed set up for quad polo. Quad polo is this game we invented that's extremely dangerous and uh, doesn't make a whole lot of sense, but it's fun as fuck. Basically, there's a giant ball, four quads, two versus two, two people per quad. Each team has a driver and a hitter. The one on the back has the stick. And what you want to do is hit the ball in between the cones uh, and you score. So it's fucking carnage and uh, you'll see, you'll see it's sick. I guess I'm kind of the referee here, so. Good defense, good defense. They're pushing it forward. Couldn't quite convert, goal's over here. They got a breakaway. He shoots, he's defended, defended. All right, we're resetting. They got a breakaway, they're going towards the goal. We got 2v1. Can you get it over? Goal! Goal! Wow! So 1 0. Looking for control, swinging mallets like it's nobody's business. Do we have dental insurance, is what I'm wondering. She's got good control, she's blocked. Good D. Stops it, but the quad's going. This might be two. Good D, though. Lost control. Now we got a breakaway. We got a breakaway. The star players in this team, can they tie it up? Can they tie it up? But they got D. Oh, missing by inches. We lost one. Good D. Goal! Goal! 2-0, we've got a quad malfunctioning. I'm hopping on the big rig, and I'm getting in this fucking game. Let's see if we can make some magic happen out there.
a little bit of a carnage sort of an end to quad polo. I think we're ending it there. Shit's fun. Let me know if you guys like quad polo in the comments. Ah, green guests on my podcast? I don't know. Let's spice things up a little. One of my exes. <laughs> Alright guys, we're at the end of night number three. Um, super fucking fun day. We did quad polo. We did a bunch of riding. We played volleyball. And of course, we did a lot of drinking and eating. 0.16. I'm drunker than when I did the fucking grow bar last night. Hello. It's the next morning. Uh, we're going for a little dirt bike ride. I think the trail is called something like Unalived Cattle or something like that. What is it? Dead, dead cow. I don't have an enduro take on this bad boy, so I gotta bring some extra gas with me and my camel back. Probably 0.01% of the population will ever see this trail. Ah! All right, guys, pretty sweet spot. Came all the way down this. This is all waterfalls and stuff. It's fucking bitching, man. Another cool fucking spot. That right there is Green River. You can see somebody right there rafting. This is the trail. Look at my fucking buddy's setup first bed that's pretty foul <laughs> no sheet <laughs> one blanket <laughs> pair of shorts and a pillow oh my god the man the myth the legend radar hi charlie okay we're playing power hour you have to drink a shot of beer every minute for an hour 1v1 my roommate who's my best friend and uh lost we played for a freedom funnel so uh fucking cheers <laughs> did i say we played cornhole bird shit you put booze in you get freedom out back in stock crowbar freedom funnels ah! brownie. brownie all right how much does it cost four, four? <laughs> I, i've only got one dollar can you do one dollar okay Thank you. You added the sprinkles and everything? Look. <laughs> really good. <laughs> Should I maybe have another bite? Yes. <laughs> maybe the second bite's better. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you guys so much. Fucking scammers. It's just dirt. It's not actual cake. Paid a dollar to take a bite of dirt. <laughs> And I thought it was fucking real cake. <laughs> they said they had a whole establishment with permits and everything. <laughs> Dinner was delicious. Only took two bites. <laughs> this is the fourth and final night. Goodbye. First off, shout out, Boonsie. What an absolute fucking unit. Point one four five. Those are rookie numbers. Need to get those numbers up. Super fun trip. Great to see all the parents. Did a little crowbar, did a bunch of shit, quad polo. Let me know in the comments if you guys like this type of video. I'll keep doing them. Hit the fucking subscribe button, help your boy out, and uh, you'll be able to see all the other videos. Um, anyways, thanks for watching, and I hope you enjoyed.